Hola amigos, welcome back to my channel. In the last episode, I mentioned that I will show you the Castanho Beach in Colombia as well as my accommodation here. So let's go. But before that, remember to subscribe to my channel, give this video a thumbs up and follow my Instagram. If you would like to support my journey, I do have a Patreon page or you can buy me a coffee. The links are in the description box. After the bus drop you off on the main road, you have to walk this pathway for around 20 minutes or you can choose to hire a motorcycle which will cost you 4,000 COP which is like one dollar since I came with a suitcase so I hired two motorcycles one for myself and one for my suitcase in this case I had to pay 8,000 COP which is like two bucks this is how it works you either carry your backpack or you give it to the guy and then they put it at the front Oh, by the way, if you take a motorcycle, remember to remove everything from your pocket, especially your phone. Basically, I don't see any taxi on the road, so I don't know where does it come from. Just keep in mind that you must need a motorcycle to give you a ride at some point. I came here from Palomino two days ago. Um, it was like a 15 minutes bus ride and they charged me 7,000 COP which is like a dollar and 75 cents. Now let's go into the place I stay. So this is the entrance. It has some solar panels. So um, that's one socket in the room that you can use the fan or charge your phone. This is the reception area. Um, you can buy water and drinks here those are the rooms I think it has more rooms than before so this is my room it has a little patio thing <laughs> um, two chairs and a table okay we have to go up from here You can wash your shoes here. Um, a carpet. It has a double bed and a single bed here. A fan. That's what I mentioned before, where you can plug your fan or charge your phone here. Curtain, but um, they don't have curtain on this side somehow you can somehow you can look at the sea from this window this part is the washroom and it has um, a safe here I don't know how to use it it's very tiny um, a storage area it's plastic <laughs> and then I put my stuff here oh this socket, it doesn't work. This place doesn't have an AC, they only provide you a fan, um, but I don't have to turn it on at all. For the shower, it's cold water only, and this property doesn't have Wi-Fi and restaurants. However, if you eat in the restaurants around this area, they do have Wi-Fi, and my phone can receive mobile data. Since I stay here at the beginning of the week, I find that it's quite quiet at night, so I can sleep properly. Now you may ask how much it is, right? It's around $40 per night, but it really depends if you book on the weekday or the weekend or, you know, those very popular holiday season. Now let's go out to walk around. That's the entrance I just showed you. That's my room. Now we go to the beach. If you want to go to all the other restaurants um, around this area, you have to pass through this beach. Um, the water here is very rough so uh, you can't really swim here beach warning I don't see any flag here at all but anyways let's have a dip since I'm already here oh come on hey 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 This is the first restaurant or hostel right next to my hotel. Mm -hmm. 
it has um, table tennis table and a swimming pool on that side some hammocks you can do a massage here one hour is 50,000 CUP it's around the pool but nobody uses it at the moment I think the accommodation here looks like this oh dorm room one fan washroom right here they have menu of the day 18,000 it's not like a restaurant it's more like a food court <laughs> because they gave me this I have to pick up the food by myself I moved to indoor because outside is way too sunny let me show you my lunch this is the menu with soup um, some rice, beans, salad I guess this is chicken um, this set is 18,000 CLP and I ordered some pineapple juice 6,000 CLP so totally it's around $8 it's not that bad in a touristic area because they can easily rip you off there are quite many dogs on this beach I'm not quite sure if they belong to the hostels or they're just stray dogs this beach looks like a very nice walk to the restaurants but at night it is completely dark <laughs> you must bring your phone with you and the dogs they just bark at you like crazy you can play beach volleyball oh that's the flag it seems like it's always red <laughs> This is the restaurant. I come for dinner every night. The price is quite fair. Uh, like last time I had um, fish sandwich is 21,000, like five bucks. And a beer, like 6,000, like a dollar and 50. Lock off, play volleyball. <laughs> we are at the hostel called Costano Beach Hostel. It has some hammock up there, a bar at the bottom. I guess it's famous because of its swimming pool. Look at that. This is one side. Restaurant. The other side of the pool It looks like this I'm not gonna pan because people are looking at me And you know, just give them a little bit of privacy It's a whisper Ooh, that's a party tonight 8pm to 12.30am it also has yoga class and beach volleyball Maybe I'll come back a little bit later tonight and I'm glad that it's not right next to my hotel I just went back to my room and edited this video Now it's around 5.30 I think I'll go for happy hour and an early dinner Because tomorrow I will take a one hour bus to Santa Marta early in the morning and then I will take another 5 hour bus to Cartagena because Daniel Beach is nice but it will be even better if I can get an Airbnb and buy my own groceries and cook I have been eating outside for more than 10 days and my stomach is not very happy about it this is my buy one get one free mojito I'm trying to come early to use the free Wi-Fi but outside it's going to rain so they don't have electricity 
My dinner carbonara pasta with two pieces of bread and a mojito. Chiquitito, va aquí. Va aquí. Oh, yum, 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 yum. Yum, yum, yum. If you would like to follow my journey in Colombia, I have the most updated stories and photos on my Instagram account. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel and give this video a thumbs up. In the next episode, we are going to Cartagena.